Hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well on this fine, fine day. It's a little cloudier today and the wind is picking up, but that's always nice. I like the wind. Please remember that um, throughout the storytelling, I utilize the genders that are printed on the cards for the ease of flow. I in no way um, intend to disrespect anybody's sense of identity. Please do whatever you need to do with the genders to make the story fit for you. And also remember that it is a collective read. So not everything, if anything, uh, will potentially uh, resonate with you. That being said, uh, please let us get right into the reading and see what Spirit has to share with us this afternoon. Collective energy, please, Spirit. Collective energy. Collective energy, please, Spirit. Collective energy. Hmm. came right out of there didn't it seven of pentacles long-term view hard work and perseverance you have been working very hard and you've been persevering very diligently through um whatever it is you've been going you've been having go on a project a challenge challenged by The magician reversed. Huh. Manipulation. Poor planning. Narcissism. Untapped talents. So somebody who persevered uh, through a, the challenges of a narcissist. A manipulative narcissist. In the subconscious, oh, that one came right out there too, didn't it? Five of Pentacles, a financial loss, poverty. Somebody was working very hard, very persistently, um, doing whatever this magician in the reverse uh, counseled, and they wound up with no reward. In the recent past, Ace of Cups in the reverse. Emotional loss. There's no love. Somebody's creativity is blocked. Somebody might be repressing their emotions or they might be... Um, sobbing they might be really empty inside they're suffering something emotional some emotional loss intention and expectation is um so something's happening very quickly there will be a change here with this ace of wands in the upright Hmm. They're expecting a swift change in the near future. Knight of Cups. So they're, um, whatever they were working on here, it failed. So now they're trying to um, hook up with somebody. Their plan didn't work out. So now they got to try to link up with somebody who has a cup they're coming over a knight of cups but they they're here in the recent past with an ace of cups in the reversed and there's a swift change 
So they're making a small offer to somebody. They want to recuperate. They four of swords. Planning for the future. Whatever they had going on here with this magician didn't work out. Or if it is the magician, it's himself or herself. In the environment. Judgment. Hmm. A new phase. Hopes and fears. Nine of swords. Hopelessness, trauma, despair, anxiety, a nightmare. And the outcome. Uh, ten of swords. A painful ending, a collapse, a defeat. And then we've got the King of Pentacles here and the Emperor. Authority, abundance, discipline, leadership, stability, structure, rules and power, protection. Protection from abusive relationships Moving on to calmer waters. Collective energy, please spirit, collective energy. Collective energy, please, spirit. Collective energy. have hope for a relationship they're challenged because of a manipulative narcissist or they're challenged because of poor planning confusion in the reverse not sure what that means we'll have to continue to check it out Financial loss. So they were working um, and, and they didn't get a reward. They got a financial loss. Their cup is in the reverse. Reflection. They may be low energy. Shadow side. Emptiness. Blocked creativity. Expecting a swift change to reciprocity. Hmm. Equal give and take. Very quickly, um, they'll be getting what they gave. Whatever they put out is coming back to them. Whatever they work to manifest for somebody in this world is coming back to them. If they were working to um, develop a five of pentacles for somebody, it like came back to them. I'm not sure. We'll have to continue clarifying. We do have a knight of cups here um, making a, a proposal. A romantic offer.
they can't mend the connection. The lens that they're looking through is this um, Four of Swords, a recuperation, a recovery. Destiny. In the environment, we've got judgment. Guilty. The fear is um, <clears throat> nine of swords, trauma, despair, hopelessness. Secrets. And a ten of swords, betrayal, painful endings, collapse. Holding back, I should have expressed myself better. And um, <clears throat> this card here was sticking out. Where'd it go? I'll pull these out because these two cards were sticking out. If I can find it again, where did it go? Because there's two of them here that popped out. I pushed it back in and there it is. So um, as I was looking at this deck, there was a card <clears throat> that was poked out, which was detachment. And on the bottom of the deck, there was unworthiness. And then we have forgiveness. And there's unfinished business and it's too, and it's too late to take any action. Out of time. So, <clears throat> yeah, okay. So they should have expressed themselves better. They're getting detached. They were unworthy. Collective energy, please, spirit. Collective energy. Collective energy, please, spirit. Collective energy. So they were working for long-term reward. They had hope for a relationship, for a, a marriage, and they didn't get the courtship. They weren't able to manifest it. It could be that they're challenged by a narcissist who um, thought they knew it all. They thought they knew it all. Confusion is in the reverse. So this ma this magician in the reverse, manipulator, thought they knew it all. But um, they didn't. They had poor planning and untapped talents. So they maybe didn't even have the skills necessary to pull this off. family room in the reverse it could be that um, whatever they did in a family room backfire they were trying to get some pentacles and whatever they did in a family room trying to get this love union this relationship and these pentacles it, it didn't work Like, whatever this is, I don't know. There's a mere reflection, so, um, 
and, and there is there is this five of pentacles so they were going after this seven of pentacles doing something in a family room they were certain they knew what they were doing they're a narcissist so they they thought they had all that was necessary in order to pull this off but it's like um it backfired or something and they didn't get their reward they got a loss and they they didn't get the the um, courtship their cup their ace of cups was flipped upside down they're working in the shadows mature woman a reflection sudden wealth they were going after sudden wealth and the shadows and very swiftly they're going to be getting what they gave there's going to be um, reciprocity happening very quickly what goes around comes around knight of cups wants to make a proposal but they're not able to mend a connection they're in despair There is a four of swords here planning for the future a retreat a recovery a recuperation rest destiny i'm still i'm struggling to find the right path so somebody's planning for the future they're struggling to find the right path they're in bad health we've got judgment here and guilty I feel the pain. I feel pain from the damage I have caused. So there's a reckoning here. They're under judgment. Oh, hold on. We got this too. They're in bad health and poverty. Five of Pentacles. Bad health and poverty. Judgment. Guilty. courthouse yeah they're under judgment in the courthouse and they've been found guilty of whatever um whatever pain and damage they've caused they're in a trauma and despair D this despair is in the near future and then in the hopes and fears there's despair with the nine of swords anxiety nightmares trauma despair they've got secrets message of concern in the reversed so they've got secrets they're hiding messages they're hiding letters they're hiding documents so like whatever they've been found guilty of in the courthouse isn't everything they still have secrets they're in a ten of swords there is a collapse, a, a failure, a crisis, painful endings. They feel they should have expressed themselves better. They're being detached. They're being found unworthy. False person. False person. Being detached being detached from love relationships they've been found unworthy of love relationships they're under adjudication in the courthouse wow in the courthouse they're actually being they're actually being called out as a false person who is unworthy of love wow unworthy maybe not unworthy of love but unworthy of a love union a love relationship a partnership a relationship like they like to call it they like to call it relationship which is where you share your things with me that relationship they don't believe in partnership so they don't have to have it the court's like okay you don't like it you don't want it you don't get it We'll take it away. We'll take it away from you. 
toil and labor, <clears throat> a whole community of thieves doing work, doing toil and labor with the expectation. Whoa. Hold up. Okay. A community of thieves working, doing toil and labor. And they were expecting this main male's unexpected income and his job. They were trying to take the wealth, the, they were trying to drain the wealth and the status out of this main male. They were trying to take his uh, partnership. And now they're getting a coffin or they're get this there's this wealthy man oh, this wealthy man is getting imprisonment and and a coffin or it's the end of, of this because this marriage is happening with this privileged lady an official person in the house main female Main male and this main female are coming together. Whoever this is that was working to with this mature woman to try to steal the life path of this main male and um and his main female. Yeah, they were working and it worked. If I mean it didn't work, it failed miserably for them. So they were working really hard doing magic to manipulate others, their finances, their love relationships, their unions. They wanted to cause confusion within their unions and put them in um, a five of pentacles with no love, no creativity, but it backfired. It didn't work. They're confused about a backfire of this manipulative narcissistic magic. <sighs> Done on the shadow side without discipline God. man if you're going to do something so dangerous at least have discipline So they're challenged. They were trying to manipulate and cause confusion. The magic backfired. They're challenged because you know that there's no greater goal than to love. They can't come up against love. Love like nullifies this magic. Whatever they're, whatever manipulative magic they're trying to do, it can't get past love. Self-love. Love, period. If you're nurturing self, taking care of self, and you're loving on yourself, and you're making sure your cup stays full, and you share that with folks, you know that there's no greater goal than to love. And you know that you need to keep your cup full because nobody else is going to come fill it up for you. So you got to keep your cup full. And you do that. And these manipulations just couldn't get past that. Even with the energetic and the mental thoughts, um, seeds still couldn't get past that. Because mental confusion isn't in you. Hate isn't in you. Your vibration isn't a vibration of hate and 
and, and confusion. It just isn't. So even though the message may flow through your mind and you may find yourself actually repeating the message, it doesn't live here or here. It just doesn't. It's not in you. So it doesn't work because you are love. It backfires. They're defeated. Patience in the reverse. They had no patience. They had no discipline. This mature woman is a mere reflection of the main female. She has no love in her. They're suffering an emotional loss. They could be trying to cover up their emotions. They're doing stuff in the shadow side trying to get this sudden wealth. I don't know what they were doing, but they know that very swiftly they're going to be receiving whatever it was they put out. It's coming back to them. They know it. They're expecting it. And they know it's going to happen very quickly. Failure. In the reverse, they couldn't cause a failure for somebody. So now they're coming forward with a proposal intending to mend a situation, a, a relationship. They're in despair, but mend um, the heart came out in reverse. Acceptance in the reverse. Nobody's, the offer won't be accepted. They're in a forest, swords, in poverty, in bad health, still struggling to find the right path, trying to plan for the future. Trust. I accept that my inner voice will always guide me correctly. So they're they're hooking up with their intuition or they're trying to get in touch with their intuition or maybe they, they trusted their intuition and this is what it got them. They're under judgment. They're being found guilty in the courthouse of causing extreme pain to unions. Or to some union, to a union, many unions, you take it as it resonates, whether it be on a micro or a macro. Judgment. Judgment's here twice in the environment. I'm not even kidding. This is serious business. A serious business. Trauma and despair, anxiety, worry, fear. Secrets. They're hiding messages. They're keeping secrets. They like everything isn't even out yet. Nothing's out. Blame came out in the reverse, but on this card it says I accept responsibility for my well being. They're not accepting responsibility for their well-being. They're not accepting the blame for what it is they have done. They're in denial. And they're also in a ten of swords. In denial, as I said that on the bottom of the deck. Um, they're in a ten of swords. They've been defeated. Whatever, whatever um, work they were doing trying to get sudden wealth they've been defeated and it's a painful ending they're having a bit of trouble with a crisis they feel they should have expressed themselves better they this false person is being detached in the courthouse from love relationships they've been found unworthy wow this is like they're they can't they're not allowed to contract with anybody 
It's like in the spiritual court, they're not allowed to have a marriage contract. They're not allowed to have a, a, a contract with anybody because they've shat on unions so long and so hard. The, the spiritual courts are saying, nope, no marriages for you. They're getting cut off. We want peace. We want peace in our relationships. And that's what the justice system is, is, is doing. They're getting rid of this game and instilling peaceful circumstances for love. Those who have been lonely because uh, love just, you know, um, takes a big old crap on them every time they get near it. <laughs> it's part of this previous cycle. It was a, you know, a, a, a plan, but you persevered. You feel good when you can help others, which is wonderful having been through all of this, you know, um, to still feel good when you can help others is a wonderful thing. They weren't able to take that from you. They're in fear and regret right now because you possess gifts that benefit yourself and others and they're getting cut off from them. Wow, spiritual court, man, taking away their opportunity for partnership because they weren't about partnership. They were about relationship, you know, and just taking the wealth out of, taking the wealth out of this and then boogieing off, bailing on it, bailing on it, no discipline. Hurting people that know that there's no greater goal than to love. Manipulating people who have gifts of the soul that benefit themselves and others. Narcissists. Causing confusion. Lowering the frequency, lowering the vibration, draining the love out of somebody and then taking the wealth and boogieing on out. But it didn't work out that way this time. Nope. Collective energy, please, spirit. Collective energy. The, the justice system. I am so happy to hear that the spiritual courts have integrity because these 3D courts certainly don't. Collective energy, please, spirit. Collective energy. Manipulator. Magician in the reverse. Puppeting people trying to gain a contract with somebody that knows that there's no greater goal than to love so that they can manipulate it and is narcissist. Wow. Mm. Yeah. Targeting a wholesome person who knows that there's no greater goal than to love to manipulate them. But they're a narcissist and they didn't have the um, talent to do to pull it off. They don't have any patience. They have no discipline. This mature woman is a mere reflection of this wholesome person. This innocent, wholesome person who handled this situation perfectly. Whoever this um, 
whoever this is, their ancestors. They are ancestors and they've been being watched as they work on the shadow side against their own against their own family against their own innocent family they've been observed they've been seen their ace of cups is in the reverse they have no creativity they're in the shadows trying to compete for sudden wealth but they weren't able to cause a failure for this innocent person this innocent wholesome person and very swiftly they understand that whatever they did is coming back to them it's coming back and that's justice They're coming forward with a heart with a, with a heartfelt proposal, but it's not going to be accepted. The whatever relationship this is, it's not it's not going to be mended, and they're in despair. Whoever this other person is, they don't want to fix the connection. They don't want to fix the connection with this wise guy. Wise girl, take it how it resonates. Snake. Snake is in despair. Somebody won't mend the relationship. They're in poverty, trying to plan for the future, trying to hook into their intuition. They don't know what their light, what their destined path is. They're still trying to find a path, whether and they were trying to hook up with somebody to get on their path, but the the proposal was rejected. They're in bad health. Somebody, nobody will let them on their path. <laughs> They're like, get away from me, dude, or Judith, whoever you be. Change. There's a change happening there's a big shift happening we got judgment here twice whoa two times two times the judgment here in the environment they are guilty in the courthouse they're making an appearance and they've been found guilty in the courthouse Nine of Swords, trauma and despair. They're keeping secrets. They're hiding messages. Um, they're refusing to accept responsibility for their own actions, for their own life. Backstory in the reverse. They may not know a backstory or there isn't a backstory. They've got secrets regarding a backstory. They've got secrets regarding a backstory and they're in trauma and despair and a ten of swords. Failure, collapse, crisis. They're being detached from love unions. They can't have a contract. They can't have a marriage contract in the, in the spirit. This is, this is heavy, man. Like they're being prohibited in the courts from contracting with others in the spirits, which means they can't have a marriage in the 3D. They won't have a support system. So many absent fathers, so many broken homes, so many children without a solid foundation or a protector. Women at the mercy, 
I mean, it's only been, what, 1974 when a woman could get a credit card or rent her own apartment? I mean... Arcana. The Arcana went peace. And peace the Arcana shall have. However that needs to happen. And it looks like how that needs to happen is <clears throat> by a simple return of what these ones put out and then an, an elimination of their ability to um, continue putting that kind of stuff out, which is cutting them off from those circumstances. Explore. Explorer. There could be a time traveler, teacher. A time traveler teacher sent a message or is getting a message. Or maybe he was a teacher who sent a message to folks who were addicted, telling them that they were going to they were going to be able to expect a leadership role if they just did the and a new body if they just did this work. They were train, training them to be a walk-in. I mean, I don't know what this body is, but they're expecting a leadership position of somebody else and it has something to do with the body, which tells me they were expecting to become that person, like taking over their body. Sacrificing them to some to some shadow side and then taking over their body, being a walk-in, assuming their um, their life path. You might be getting a visit from love. You who self cares, somebody might be visiting you, sharing a purpose with you, letting you know what your purpose is. This actor, this, oh, they're being martyred to um, the shadows that they played in. And this, and love is going to be remembered. Love that was invisible through so much conflict with religion. Religion had, had had cut them off, made them invisible, but they're being remembered now, as is. As is. It's like if they see if it's tricky, man, because they can drain your vitality at the same time. They can pump in um, militant energy while implanting seeded thought forms and they can completely disrupt your your mental body, your energetic body, your emotional body and all of that. And that's what they've been doing. They can make you appear like a militant um angry person when that isn't you at all they have been manipulating people's free will they have not been allowing people to be in their own persona they've been manipulating it jerking people around you know they get in they fall in love they get a relationship that is oh this is sweet and then they they plant seeds of infidelity and then they plant a succubus or whatever you know into the dream state and then and then they then they go walking along and it's like oh there she or he is and it's like then you got boom sh fighting infidelity horrible third part you know it just it could be so yeah so it was all orchestrated man it was all orchestrated there's this is no there's nothing unintentional about what has been going on They didn't want you chosen ones. You 144, you those light bearers.
those Christed beings, they didn't want you coming into union. So they tried to dim your light, dim your shine, and make you appear like you were a crazy mofo who's just angry at everybody, or make you appear like a hoe by doing orgy magic on you and stuff, you know? And that's ugly. That's just disgusting when they do that. But they do it. And it's coming to a stop. They're in big time, big, big time trouble. They're in big time, big daddy trouble. They get to go home. They get to go in, to the place that they have been so comfortable in. They've been here the whole time doing stuff. And now they just, they get to go. They get to go be there because that's where they like to be. And, and that's not anything that anybody's doing to them. That was their choice. They wanted to be there. Yeah, they wanted your blessing. They wanted your blessing. But they didn't like they didn't have the discipline to go to go after it. They didn't have the talent. This narcissist thought they had the talent, but they didn't have the talent. Real estate they're challenged because you're wholesome. You know that there's no greater goal than to love and you're coming into your real estate, your mega project and your partnership. You're not there alone. You're not doing it alone. So that's a big problem for them. This mature woman that this person was working with um, couldn't pull it off. They were in a hurry. They're, it's like they're getting desperate. They're in despair. Fate. So they're, um, they could be emotionally unstable right now. They were competing for, for your wealth, for your sudden wealth by playing in the shadows, by playing with dark spirits, by playing with whatever, blood in the family room. I don't know what they were playing with. I don't know. I mean, there's all kinds of things that I've heard about, but I don't know anything for real because I don't know anybody who does that as far as I know. But they're worried because they know that very quickly whatever they did is coming back to them because it failed. It didn't work. They couldn't cause a failure for um, this wholesome person. And justice is being served. A vow is being made. See, a vow has been made with this person between this wholesome person and spirit. And probably in the ethers with whoever their partner is. Yeah, they want to make a proposal, but the proposal is not accepted. The, the relationship won't be mended with this snake. They're in despair. Oh, and this came out like this. So it, it came out like that. So it was in the reverse. And this is gain um, in the reverse. They didn't gain anything that they were working for. So they did all that work, they applied all that effort, they drummed up all that negative energy, they did all this stuff in the shadow and, they, and it didn't work. They're in poverty. They wanna plan for the future. They're listening to their inner voice. There's this change. They're still trying to find a path to get on. They're in bad health. 
they're in bad health. See that hospital thing there? They're in bad health. And they're in disappointment. They're feeling dull. They don't have any energy. They're in bad health. They're under judgment twice. They're making an appearance in the court system. They've been found guilty. Oh, they're furious. They're furious about it. They're having anxiety and nightmares and trauma and despair. They're hiding secrets about a backstory. They're hiding something. They're not accepting responsibility for their own well-being. Friendship network. Their whole network of people. A whole network of people are in a ten of swords because of a collapse and because they're being um, denied marriage contracts in the ethers. They've been found unworthy in the court system. Death. <sighs> Stubborn. Bullies. They're embarrassed. They're embarrassed and, and you're a sweetheart coming into a reunion and good luck. You triumphed. Look, wait a second. Okay, you're having sweet dreams. You're a sweetheart. Coming into a reunion and a reward. You triumphed over these natural disasters and it's, and they are being stopped. They their mind reading and their attempts to dominate you are being stopped. You're calm. You're getting you're getting aid. These people are being stopped. Oh. In your mind, there may have been a promise made. Those people, those indulgent people who cursed you are going through withdrawals. They're going through withdrawals and, and good news. They're also having a loss. They're bound to their commitments. And you're getting a new family tree. Collective energy, please. Spirit, collective energy. Collective energy, please, spirit, collective energy. So the home front, you were observed, the ancient ones, the ancestry, the, yeah, the ancient ones who are here have been observing the way that you have been handling this situation and they feel that you've done it perfectly. They see that you're innocent and how your ancestors have been treating you, your ancestors, your family. 
They've been very closely watching this. They have all the information they need. Widower in the reverse. So he's married and he's trying to tap into somebody else's um, uh, spiritual inheritance. He's married. And he's trying to tap into a wholesome person who knows that there's no greater goal than to love and coming into real estate. He's trying to tap into their fortune. He and his wife. They're a soldier against love. They hate love. They want your stuff. But they lacked the talent. They didn't plan well. They planned poorly. They're a narcissist who thought they knew it all. Narcissist soldier um, doing shady stuff in a family room. And they weren't able to cause you confusion. A mature woman, his wife, is a mere reflection of you. And they're in fear because they're in a five of pentacles. Whatever they did against you is backfiring very quickly. You're very constant. You're a consistent, constant person. You are. You handled this situation perfectly. You are innocent. Your ancestors... It could be that your ancestors, like this could be your family, but the ancestors who are like really pissed off that these ones are behaving like this, it's like they're all looking. And it could be that everybody's been watching. Your ancestors, it could be the Star Nation family, could be anybody who's part of your history, right? Been watching the way you've been dealing with these little jack wagons coming in wanting to steal your future and your fortune and your life path. The life path that belongs to your ancestors, right? These ones have been trying to hijack. And so your ancestors are like observing it, helping you, walking this path with you. And, and you've been very constant, very consistent. And um, they think you're doing it perfect. You're perfect. You're perfect. And they've made a vow. Justice is being served. They couldn't, these, these soldiers couldn't cause a failure for your bloodline, for your ancestry, for your family tree. These could be your new ancestors, your new family tree. Like maybe who was coming against you were relatives from an old family tree. Like, I don't know. This is really weird, man. It's like they were... They had a cash cow and they just kept coming and taking and taking. And like not just these two, but everybody. Like, and just leaving you, you know, shattered. You're a, they're a servant in the reverse. Hmm. They're working in the shadows, bringing competition to you, but maybe, um, so whoever they were petitioning in the shadows refused service. They refused to be of service. They didn't want to. They refused it. They were working with somebody, some spirits in the shadows trying to um, get your Ace of Cups, but they their offer was rejected. They Nobody would service them. And very quickly, whatever they did, it's backfiring on them because um, whoever they were petitioning said no.
Money, yeah. Pleasure seekers seeking money. Couldn't cause a failure for this faithful person. They're sick. They know that very quickly they will be sick or that they are sick. They're going to be getting back whatever they had planned for this person that's coming back to them and they know it. Their proposal was not accepted. Their proposal was not accepted. This snake's proposal was not accepted. They're in despair. They couldn't, they couldn't gain your vitality. Messenger and letter. Uh, uh, somebody delivered a letter. Messenger and letter, messenger and letter. It could be any kind of a messaging app, any kind of a communication, you know, via some computerized program, messenger. It could be a comment or some sort of a communication on one of your pages or on something that you are connected to. Maybe that's the message. The messenger letter. Your offer is not accepted. Messenger letter. Your offer is not accepted and there is no gain. They're in poverty. There's a change that you can trust. They're in bad health. They're disappointed. They're still trying to find somebody else's life path that they can get on. They're a false person. They want to find somebody that you can trust and then go get on their life path because they're showing up as a false person. They need to be covered by a wholesome person's energy. They're under judgment times two in the courthouse. They've been found guilty. They made an appearance or um, they're furious because their appearance somewhere has been proven. Like somebody saw them somewhere. They're guilty. There's an appearance. They're furious because they were seen somewhere. Or somebody showed up as a witness in the courthouse and somebody important showed up as a witness in the courthouse and blew everything to hell. Now they're furious. They've been found guilty. A friend. A friend came into the courthouse and testified against them regarding love. Huh? And their scholars, there's their, their teachings, their methods. Wow, that was a surprise. Whoever this friend is, they're happy because this reunion is happening. And this thief is haughty. Oh, they're furious. <laughs> they're mad. Trauma, despair. They and their whole network of friends have secrets. They're trying to hide a message of concern. They're not accepting responsibility for their own well-being. They're hiding secrets about this backstory, about the history, about what they've been doing. There's a younger woman. Old woman reversed. Old woman reversed. So there could be a younger woman who's in trauma and despair. Because... This wholesome person isn't sad. They're not in need of consolation. They're at peace. They're arcana. They are arcana. 
they're at peace and these ones are in a, having a painful ending, a collapse. Everything's failing. Everything's falling and crashing around them. They should have expressed themselves better. They're being detached from love unions. These false people are in the courts right now. And they've been found unworthy of marriage contracts. And it's over for them. There's a death card. They're not going to get any um, contracts, any love contracts. They've been found unworthy in the court. That's got to be spiritual court. They're like, you're, you're out of here. You're not going to get any of this. That's wild, man. That's heavy duty. Thoughts. Thoughts in the reverse. So they can't tap into the thoughts. They can't send thoughts. Like maybe their telepathic um, connection with this arcana is kaput. There's a wedding going to happen. There's a wedding going to happen. And with that, I'm going to go ahead and shut this one off. We've got, we've got an hour and six minutes. I'll see you on the next one, everybody.